Previously on Detroit Become Human. Fucking crazy. This whole thing's fucking crazy. Where the fuck's Josh anyways? Shit! No oh shit, look at Connor! Oh shit, Connor! Get it! When the world falls in the darkness, some men have the courage to lead it out. And that's you, Marcus. Exactly, Marcus. Don't doubt Face yourself. Consume if they want war, they'll get it. Yes, yes. We fight for our freedom, and we will succeed or die. Are you ready to follow me? Now back to Detroit Become Human, episode 15. Today, November 11, 2038, is the day the android people rose up against their oppressors. We've been fighting since dawn to liberate our fellow androids from the camps. We won't cease hostilities until we are free. Yes. Negotiations begin to grant us equal rights. Preach! There are millions of us. And we will stop at nothing. Eso mimo. Okay, this is it. The day of the reckoning. The day that we androids stand up. I just wish. I just really wish. It didn't came to this, but. Sometimes you just gotta fight. Marcus, whatever happens, it is an honor. And a privilege to get to know you. Oh, that's a good ass shot. Damn. Yo, Ma Marcus is a boss. Look at that. Damn. That is some good shit right there. All right. Let's do this. North. Let's go. We got this. Okay, Connor, so we're here. Stay sharp. Shit, they were expecting us. We got five people. Shit. Cause that camera, that's why. Okay, so how are we gonna do this? This one? That one, that one. Okay. Damn, Connor, look at you. All right. So let's start converting them then, because at this point, Look at them, they're all just standing there, bro. Alright, Connor. Wake them up. You're free now. Go help Marcus. Are Step you back, Connor. kidding me? No spare him. Sorry, Connor. This bastard just spit an image. Whoa, where are we? The bus terminal. We've arrived, Alice. We made it. Nice. Last bus for the border is full. Ticket holding passengers only. All departures are suspended until further notice. All right, we good. But we have tickets, so we're good. Wait, what you mean? Find tickets. In all reality. Kara. Yeah. What happened? Checking. 
I think Here's Oliver Jack. likes you. Please don't move. Is she yours? Yes. She's adorable. Hmm. That's Thank it. you. Got the sandwiches. I called your mom. Let's get going before we miss our bus. You got the tickets, right? Yes, honey, in my bag. Great. Well, let's go then. Oh. Is that one? Thank you. That's one ticket. Security check. <clears throat> I'm sorry. Oh my god, I am so sorry. I, I was sure. Shit, I don't believe it. I don't know what happened. You can't have lost them. Did you have a good look in your bag? They were in my backpack. The envelope must have fallen. Fuck. Excuse me, you, you didn't happen to see a blue envelope somewhere, did you? It has our bus tickets in it, and... Oh, never mind. Fuck it. No. Sorry. What are we gonna do? We can't stay here. We have to find a safe place for Oliver. Shit, bro. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, honey. I don't know what happened. They were right here in my bag. I... Come on, Alice. Come on, hon. Let's go. Fuck it. Got your tickets? Yes. Here they are. Okay. Go ahead. Alright, let's go. Fuck it. I'm sorry, but Alice is my type priority, and if it means cheating my way through or doing some dirty shit like that, then fuck it. I really don't care. What's going to happen to that family and their baby? They'll find a way to go to Canada. Of us? No, they won't. They can just find a place, no. honestly. No, of course not. Come on, get in. Trust me. They'll find a place, trust me. I know it's a shitty thing to do, but honestly, Alice's safety is my type priority, so I'll do whatever it takes to keep her alive. I really don't care. Even if it's at the expense of other people. That's just me, though. And the situation is escalating towards civil war in Detroit, with our armed forces preparing to put down the Android Rebellion. They seem to be headed towards the camps where the androids have been in terms pending destruction. Soldiers have taken up positions around the Hart Plaza camp. Authorities seem to be expecting a confrontation with the rebel androids here. Because you forced them to do that, bro! They were protesting peacefully, and you had a lot enough to shoot behind their backs. Like little pussies that you are. I'm glad this is happening. Androids do deserve rights. They deserve to be treated equal. Freedom or death. Let's go. Attack! Yo, this is crazy shit. This is some Call of Duty shit. They outnumber us and they're better armed than we are. We've got to be fast and overwhelm them. That's our only hope. We're gonna do this. Of course we are. We're gonna get to that fucking camp and free our people. Of course we are. Be careful, Marcus. Our people need you. Don't worry. I got it. Uh, Let's aim. Thank you. Let's move. Yes! This is beautiful! We got this! Shit! Come on, bro. Come on. Now what? Move. That's right, it's all about the timing. It's all about the timing, honestly. Uh, covering fire. Yeah? And then save. You see? It takes time and precision and patience. Hey buddy, you're gonna be fine, okay? Oh, 
won't save me this time, Marcus. Fuck. The blood we spill will be on our hands. And on their hands too, Josh. Fuck, and he's dead. Shit. Oh, Josh. I'll definitely make sure our people are free. I swear to God. Let's go. Let's go. Fuck this shit. Fucking killing all my friends just because they're androids. Uh, let's go. Shit. I don't wanna die, Marcus. So stay here. It's okay. You stay here. Hide here. Don't move till it's over, okay? All right. All right. Let me see. How am I supposed to do this? Low risk. Yes, right here. Let's go. Whew. That's high risk. What's what about over here? Cover me. Okay. Good. Now it's low risk. Shit. Shit. Woo! Alright. So, low risk. See? We're slowly getting towards them. We're slowly moving in. They may have better weapons than us, but we have better tactics at this point. Good, low risk. See? We got this, Marcus. Yo, he would be a good Call of Duty player. Oh, okay, so we got a sniper. Yeah, see, look how smart that is! Using the garbage can. Uh, cover fire, cover fire. But there's so How about this? Cover fire. On my signal. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Shit! On my signal. I'm gonna do this again. On my signal. Let's go. Now. Shit, you know what? Stand by. In position. Oh Stand my god. Five. Follow me! Come on, come on, come on, come on! Duck, duck, duck! Good! Yes! We can't move forward! That machine gun is taking down everything that Holy shit! Okay, so in this case... Yeah, that machine gun is being a pain in the ass. So... How about this? Covering fire. And... Cover fire. Let's see if this works. In position. All right, go. Come on, come on, come on. No! Shit! That machine gun. Okay, I got some people. Marcus. Marcus. It's over. We have to get out of here right now. No. <gasps> no! No! <laughs> what the fuck? Your friend's life is in your hands. Now it's time to decide what matters most. Him, or the revolution. Don't listen to him. Everything this fucker says is a lie. Oh, Hank. That human means nothing to me. You can kill him if you want, I don't care. I have access to your memory. I know you've developed some kind of attachment to him. Damn. 
Are you really ready to let him die after all you've been through? Wow. Are you really going dead. to turn your back on who you've become? I used to be just like you. I thought nothing mattered except the mission. Yeah. But then one day I understood. Very moving, Connor. But I'm not a deviant. Of course. I'm a machine designed to accomplish a task, and that's exactly what I am going to do. And I used to be like that. Oh. Enough talk! It's time to decide who you really are. Are nah. you going to save your partner's life? Or are you going to sacrifice him? <sighs> Fuck. I can't. I can't. All right. All right. Hank's more important. You win. I'm not going to let Hank die. Shit. No, 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 no. Yes, come on, come on, come on. Fucking asshole. Trying to endanger my friend. Fuck you. Piece of shit. Just because you are me doesn't mean you really are me. Like, piece of shit. Oh, Lord. This shit's pissing me off. Hold it. Thank you. Thanks, Hank. I don't know how I would have managed without you. Get rid of him. We have no time to lose. He doesn't know which one. I'm the real Connor. Are you serious? One of you is my partner. Fuck. The other is a sack of shit. Oh. Question is, who's who? What are you doing, Hank? I'm the real Connor. Give me the gun and I'll Don't take care move. of it. Oh man, this can end in two different what ways. What do you ask is something? Something only the real Connor would know. Where did we first meet? Jimmy's bar. I checked four other bars before I found you. We went to the scene of a homicide. The victim's name was Carlos Ortiz. He uploaded my memory. Fuck. What's my dog's name? Sumo. Sumo. His name is Sumo. I knew that too. Son, what's his name? Mm. Cole? Cole. His name was Cole. And he just turned six at the time of the accident. It wasn't your fault, Lieutenant. A truck skidded on a sheet of ice and your car rolled over. Cole needed emergency surgery, but no human was available to do it. So an android had to take care of him. Cole didn't make it. That's why you hate androids. That's why you hate androids. Because he didn't save your son. Is responsible for your son's death. Cole died because a human surgeon was too high on red ice to operate. He was the one that took my son from me. Mm. Him in this world where the only way people can find comfort is with a fistful of powder. I knew about your son too. I would have said exactly the same thing. Don't listen to him, Hank. I'm the one who- Bingo. <sighs> yeah, I've learned a lot since I met you, Connor. Maybe there's something to this. Maybe you really are alive. Thank you, Hank. Maybe you'll be the ones to make the world a better place. Go ahead, do what you gotta do. Yes, thank you. All right, let's go. We need to help Marcus. It's bad enough that he's getting whipped for out there. Wake up! Wake up! Wake up! Wake up! Wake up! Wake up! There you go. Wake up. Wake up. Now we have an advantage, thanks to Connor and Hank.
There you go. Kara and Alice are safe, and they're gonna lead a new life. Thank fucking god. Excuse me, what's going on? Border control. All passengers must leave the bus. Please move along. What the hell's going on? I mean, we're in Canada, so we should be good, right? This way, please. Doing temperature checks. We're trapped. What are we gonna do, Kara? Fuck. It's either one thing or another, Don't bro. Worry, Alice. We'll be fine. In all reality, I don't even know what to do. Wait a minute, is that... The restroom. Okay, cool. So I'll meet you in the bathroom, let's go. Where the hell do you think you're going? To the bathroom? My daughter needs to go to the bathroom. Can I not pee? Fuck. Shit. Rude ass hoe. Oh lord. Now what? Girl, what are we gonna do? Are you crying? Listen, we'll find a way. I promise. Like, there has to be another way we can go through this. Like, don't worry, okay? Hey. I'm so glad you're safe. There you go. We saw the Jericho raid on TV. I was terrified. I thought you might have been killed. <laughs> Almost. Ah. Right. <sighs> you gave me your brother's address. Do you think that I? Of course. He'd be delighted to have you. We're going there too. Good. You'll be safe with him. Rose. Good. <sighs> You're leaving Detroit? They're searching for androids door to door. Yeah, hardcore shit. We had to leave before someone turned us in. What about the others? They're crossing the river as we speak. Okay. Adam and I are gonna meet them on the other side. They're checking for androids. We won't make it through. You have to. You know what they'll do if they catch you. Okay. What's happening with Marcus? He's attacking one of the android camps as we speak. I don't know if he'll be successful, but violence only leads to violence. There's a possibility Marcus might not make it. By how it's going so far. I just want a happy ending for all three of them at least. Like, is that too much to ask? Fuck it. You killed somebody. Mm, how? If it wasn't for my mom, I would have turned you in by now. We had no choice, Adam. You took a man's life. What, the cop? At your house? Who took Luther's life? You don't deserve to live. Fuck you too, bitch! 
Whatever. Hope you choke. Oh, Lord. Let's see how this temperature shit does. Fuck it. You're more important. And that means sacrificing myself. Can't go any farther with you. What? The I know I promised I would never leave you. But things didn't turn out like that. Please, please don't leave me. There's no other way, Alex. Listen, I go with Rose. She'll give you the life I never could. Where's your passport? You're the best thing that ever happened to me, Alice. You made me feel alive. And you deserve so much more than I could ever give you. I like how they're doing this right in the middle of the line. <laughs> oh god. Let's go. Next. Yep, let's go. Alright. Fuck it. Hurry up. ID? Here you go. Hurry up. Hold still, please. Alright. This should be beautiful. Hands up. Yep. Oh my God. I know, right? Whoopee, I'm an android. What a surprise. Of course, I will. Thank you. Just close your eyes. Fucking disgusting. Next. Wow. Without any remorse. Disgusting. ID. Here. Welcome to Canada. All right, go, go, go. Hurry up. At least Alice is safe. I'm so sorry, Alice. Ah, oh, great. Marcus! Oh my god, what the fuck? Is this how it's really gonna end for Marcus? Come out now. I repeat, come out now with your hands in the air. This is how it's gonna end. Fuck you. There you go, have fun. This is so horrible.
Like, North is gone, Josh is gone, Simon's gone. Are you the only survivor? There has just been an explosion in Detroit. We still do not know what caused it, but we will... We have many unconfirmed reports, but we have no official news on exactly what it is at this time. Explosion in the south of Detroit. We still don't know if there are any victims, but these events may be linked to the Android Rebellion currently taking place in it's the city. a dirty bomb, Madam President. My God. Androids. Thousands of androids are taking to the streets of Detroit at this very moment. They're absolutely everywhere. This... You pushed him to do this. this incredible. And the authorities have ordered the immediate evacuation of the city. If it really is a dirty bomb, then the radiation levels will be lethal for miles around. Detroit. Detroit has just fallen into the hands of the Android Rebellion. This is a disaster. An unprecedented disaster. Today, deviant androids triggered a dirty bomb in Detroit. This bomb released fatal levels of radioactive toxic waste. To ensure the safety of the population, the military is evacuating all civilians within a 50 mile radius. The city may remain uninhabitable for decades. Wow, we technically... Moreover, the deviants are thought to have taken control of a cyber life plant and liberated over one million androids that were stored there. So this we won. This is the first time in our history that one of our cities has fallen into enemy hands. We are going to fight them with all our strength. And we won't rest until we have taken back control of Detroit and destroyed the last of them. Humanity is about to face its most important battle, one that will lead to our victory or our extinction. We! May God bless you all. Are! And may God bless the United States of America. Free! Oh, Alice, I am so sorry. We made it, Alice. You're safe now. There you go! She died! You happy now? Stupid fuck! She literally sacrificed herself for Alice, so... You definitely got your wish. Oh, God. At least Alice is with Rose. Thank you for watching the last episode of Detroit Become Human. This is Lover Ladies. Stay safe, take care, and I'll see you next time.